Hey there everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com and want to take a quick look at a cool new news reader called Flood, F-L-U-D, like a flood of news. Uh, it's actually been around on iOS for a long time and now we have it on Android. Now first and foremost, any news reader that starts out with Holly Berry in a bikini is probably alright with me. Uh, here is the general gist of it though, you have feeds and then you scroll vertically to uh, get the stories in each feed. So those are the kind of featured ones. They give you a bunch of feeds in here by default. There's Behance, if you've never seen that very cool site, Devour. Uh, TechCrunch is on there. You got Twitter, so you can plug Twitter into it as well. Uh, put in your credentials and you're on your way. Android Central! All right, so I've added that uh, and a bunch of the other SPE sites. So take a quick look and you see you get a main story up top and then uh, more stories down on the bottom as you scroll through. So let's just maybe tap one and go into the story. And I actually like the way this looks a lot. Uh, I'd like the image to be a little bigger maybe, but it's a really nice way to present the stories. The headline looks nice. Very, very cool. And you see there, it's uh, actually refreshed itself now. Uh, so you can hit the little heart button and you now have options for sharing and favoriting stories. You can share them through all the usual stuff. Or if you do uh, the heart itself, it'll kind of bookmark and we'll show you more of that in a second. Here's a quicker way to hop through all your feeds that you have on here. Get a little scroll bar down at the bottom and it will go back and forth. Now you see the app seems to be a tad laggy at time. Not bad, but just little tiny UI things like that. Not enough to really frustrate me, but just so you know it's there. Here's how you add more feeds so you can search, find news if you want to use that. My news, and these are all of the ones that you currently have listed on Flood, so you see those are the ones we were scrolling through. If you want to kill one, you just hit the X. Bye, TechCrunch. See ya. Uh, Google Reader. Google Reader, Google Reader, there it is. So you uh, put in your Google credentials and it actually has all of your Google Reader feeds on here. I have several hundred, so it's kind of a pain, but there's Android Central. So if you wanna add one, you check it. If you wanna get rid of it, you can uncheck it there. And then finally, you can tell people about Flood, which is kind of cool. So let's go back to the uh, main feeds screen. And again, you see your hearts down there and there's your heart up here. So if you wanna go to all your hearted, you know, bookmarks, hearted stories, that's how you can do it. Uh, you got refresh, so we'll refresh real quick. And then you have your settings button up here as well. So you can also get to it down at the bottom. So anything else we want to see? That's it. Pretty much uh, kind of a standard reader, but graphically very nice. Kind of a little bit like Pulse. Um, not too intensive. I think I'm going to like this one a lot, actually. So there you go, guys. A quick look at Flood for Android. We'll see you later.